In this session, we're going to have a look at how you might want to save your presentation uh, using Screenhaven. So let's go into Screenhaven itself and instead of going off and subscribing, we're going to have a look at the uh, publish side of things here. Now we have uh, in this circumstance gone off and uh, created a presentation before. There's a number of different uh, slides up on the server. Uh, if we come down to the comments window, we can see there's different comments and things there. Uh, the difference with publish as opposed to subscribe is we can't see our own screens easily. We can get a little image uh, in here as to what, what might be sent up for the moment, but all of those other um, uh, 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 images that, that have gone up to the server uh, aren't available on our computers here. So we can uh, click on start and they're sending them up, but how do we know? How do we keep a record of the presentation ourselves? Now we could go and subscribe to our own presentation and use the saved the same techniques that way, but there's actually an easier way. If uh, you look down the bottom here, we have the ability to uh, save a picture. So let me just pause the presentation. It's still available for others on the server. Uh, the, our latest image, if we want, we can click on picture here, save that image to the desktop, and there we go. That, that's the latest image that we we're working on that's available on the server. Okay. <coughs> If we wanted to save a copy of all of the images that we have um, uh, cached locally and, and sent to the server, we can click on the Pictures button here. So I'll now save that to the desktop and you can see that there's seven items inside there and there we go. There's all of our images that we've, that we've had for us stored up on the server, brought down and saved as JPEGs. Okay. Let me close that down. So we can save uh, just the latest picture, uh, all of our pictures that we have on the server, or we can save them as a movie, just like the subscribers can save as a movie. Let me come back here and click on movie, and I'll save this to the desktop as well. And again, it will save, just like it does with subscribe, it'll save uh, one uh, picture per second as one QuickTime movie file. So we can click on here, and there are the pictures one after the other. It's a, a, a standard size uh, movie, 1020 uh, 1024 pixels by 768, uh, ready to, if you want, put into a presentation or anything like that. Now that's fine for the images, the picture, the pictures and the movie, but what about the text? Now, just like in the subscribe menu, we still have the ability to go and speak text. Is the marketing done yet? We have the ability to right click and speak text. We have the ability if we've uh, asked it to uh, ask to speak too much text, we can cancel the speaking of the text. Uh, we can save the images and things like that before. But we also have the ability under here to, to uh, save our comments as text. Or if we come down here and click on this save button, it'll ask us where do we want to put them and it'll give us the time of which we're saving them just in case uh, we're saving comments and then more comments get added on it'll save them as a separate file so if I come down here to my desktop and have a look at that there we go we can see the text which we can load up into any word processor it's just a normal txt file so that is how we can save our presentation that we may be the ones giving it uh, saving either the latest image uh, a series of JPEGs, um, a, the whole thing as a movie, and even the comments made all the way through the presentation, we can save them as a record of that meeting as well. And there's no reason why uh, those things, the uh, the comments and the, the movie, for example, we can't drop into Dockhaven as well to keep that as a record of an offline record of the meeting for others to pick up on. Okay, so that's how uh, uh, saving uh, our presentation works within Screenhaven. I hope you find that useful. Thank you, and goodbye.